Hey, my name's Alice. I'm gonna teach you how to do Breath of Fire. This is the best breathing tool for trauma and for rewiring your nervous system. Relaxation, just anything that needs to get you back to baseline, this is amazing for. Breath of Fire, check it out. Okay, so what we're gonna do, it's super simple. We're only gonna focus on the out breath and we're gonna do it through the nose. So we close our mouth and then we're gonna breathe out. And when we breathe out, we're gonna move this, we're gonna move the stomach and the diaphragm rapidly inside forcefully. So we're gonna go. So this is like you have a little bee right there that you're trying to snuff off, or you might be trying to blow out a candle, or you might look like a bull in a cartoon where they get mad and the air just comes out in their nose. Okay, so another way of showing you, watch this. See, when I blow out, I'm all I'm doing is And what happens, you let the rest of your breath do itself naturally. So the rest of the breath comes naturally after you blow out. So all, like I said, all you're focusing on is the out breath and your body's gonna do the rest. So you're gonna go out breath, out breath, out breath, out breath, out breath. Or if you aren't um, built up to going so fast, you go whatever speed is comfortable for you such that your breath, you don't lose your breath. So you don't get out of breath. This should be something that you could continue indefinitely, ideally. And so you have to find your own pace. But I'm gonna go out breath, out breath, out breath, out breath. And I want you to watch my stomach and then I'm gonna put up my scarf and show you as well, okay? So. put up my scarf so you can see the breath coming out. So the stomach goes in when the breath goes out. Okay. So use this if you're doing Kundalini yoga for one. If you're doing any kind of yoga, this can be a really good thing to add in into a meditation. Particularly if you're doing a meditation, you can start out with breath of fire and then do some slow mountain breaths and you can find the instruction for mountain breath and some other types of breath on my other, on other shorts on my channel or on very short videos that don't necessarily count as a short. So try this. If you're having any kind of emotions coming up, if you feel like panic coming on, sit with the panic and do breath of fire for one to three minutes or however long feels comfortable to you. The main rule of your life and in any kind of physical practice that you're gonna do is that you need to listen to your body and take what your body is telling you feels good because your body knows what it needs. If you have panic coming up, you don't need to use your brain, your mind, your thinking self, your ego to take care of it because you can go straight to the breath because that is the continuous recorder in your brain. It prints over and over again. So every time you do an out breath, you're printing whatever feelings are in your body and you're spitting out the negative stuff. You're flushing it all out. So do breath of fire, practice it. You can also do a variation where you switch nostrils and go. So each time I'm blowing out in an alternate nostril and holding just lightly right there on my nose, if you hold just lightly, then your nose knows not to, your nose knows not to try to take in through air through there. So if I do that, I'm breathing into the right side of my brain. And if I do that, I'm cross hatching to the left side of my brain. And so when you do alternate, then you're doing a lot of balancing and then you can finish it up with the regular breath of fire. Close your eyes, point your eyes towards your third eye. That's the other thing about your position. Otherwise, it's okay to sit however you want, sit cross-legged, sit comfortably on a chair, do whatever feels good. If you're in, if you need to take a break and go to your car and sit there, if you need to take a break and go outside, say you're going to go have a coffee break and go do, do a couple minutes of breath of fire, take a bathroom break, go in the privacy of a bathroom, and do this for one to three minutes. 
it is amazingly powerful and it's such an easy tool. So breath of fire, you go try it.